everyone, how's it going? So for today's video, I want to show you guys how to draw Humongosaur from the Ben 10 series. Now, if you guys have some other characters from this series that you would like me to draw, please let me know and I would love to try out some new ones. So hope you guys follow along and enjoy this video today. Now to start off with Humongosaur, we're gonna begin with the eyes. I'm gonna start right here and we're gonna make a line that's gonna go down and that's going to come up like this. And I'm gonna do the same thing over here. I'm gonna leave some space, I'm gonna go down, I'm gonna come up like a little check mark. Next, I'm gonna make a line that's gonna go out and it's gonna curve up here. Same thing here, we're gonna go down and then curve up. Inside of here, we're gonna make a little line that goes down and it's gonna curl around. One right here, down and then curl around. And I'm going to color in this area right around the eye. Starting here, we're gonna make a line that goes down and it's going to curve in. And then another one's gonna curve out like this. Up here, we're gonna make a line that's gonna go out. It's gonna come up and then down like this for the top of the head. Right here, we're gonna go down and we're gonna come in and then down again. Starting here, we're gonna make a line that's gonna go down and it's gonna curve in. Right here, we're gonna make a line that's gonna go down. It's going to curl around. It's gonna come out and then come back here. Then I'm going to add a couple little lines on here. Starting here, we're going to make a little line down for the neck. And we will continue this line down. Right here, we're going to make a line that's going to go out. It's going to curl down. It's going to come over. Little V-shape. And a line that's going to go over and then up. Right here, we're gonna make a line that's gonna come down, and then it's going to curl right to here. Inside here, we're gonna make a line that goes in. It's gonna come down, over, go up, and then curl to here. Then right here, we're gonna make a line that's gonna go in. It's gonna come down to here. Starting here, we're gonna make a line that goes down big line that's going to curl out for the shoulder, little line down, another big line that's going to curl out here. We're going to make a line that's going to come down and it's going to come back up for a thumb. This line's going to go down, it's going to go over, up, and then come back here for a finger. One a little, a little lower goes down, over, and then up, and over. Then one more here, over, up, and then over. And we're gonna add some little lines for the fingers. Make a little line, it's gonna curve out. It's gonna come up to here. And we're gonna curve this line in. Starting here, we're gonna make a line that goes down, put a little bump on it. And then another little line down. For the feet, we go out and then bring it back. One more here, down, and bring it back. One more here, bring it out to here. Now I'm gonna curl up to here. One more curls in. Then I'm going to bring it up to here. We're gonna leave some space. I'm gonna draw a line that comes down. A little notch out there for the knee. Then you bring it down a little farther. We want to make this foot just how we did this one. So you go out and then in, out and then in, and then one more time out and in. Then we're going to bring it up, a line that goes up and in, and then a little line up here. Then right here we're going to add a little line that's going to come down for the tail. Starting here, I'm going to bring this line in. I'm going to go up and then out to here. Now starting here, we're gonna draw a line that goes out. You wanna make a big curved line that comes around here for the shoulder. Little line down. 
and then another one that's going to go out and then comes down to here. We're going to make a line that's going to go down and curl up. One more that goes down and up. One right here. And I'm going to curl this around. Bring this line up. A line that goes down and that's going to curve back to here for the hand. Starting here, we're going to go up and in. Then a big curved line that's going to come all the way to here. I'm going to take this line and I'm going to go down. Now I'm going to bring this line, it's going to curve in and then come down to here. This line right here is going to curve in. Then it's going to come down and then around to here. We'll draw a little line that goes down. We'll put one line on top and then two coming through here. We'll add two little lines here. A little line that goes over, down, and up, and then one right here. I'm going to put three curved lines here, and then three more right here. I'm going to put one, two, and three lines on the neck, and then a big V shape right there. You want to add the circle in the middle of the chest. Low line that goes in like this, and another one on this side. I'm going to add a couple little curved lines on the leg, and then two more here. And then a couple right above the foot, and a little curved line for the kneecap. You want to add some curved lines for the toenails. Then the tail, you're going to make a long line that comes down. It's going to go around like this, and that's going to come back. Put a big circle shape on here. Then he's going to have some big pointed spikes coming out of here. We'll add some curved lines on here. He's going to have a couple spike shapes coming out of his back, and then these are going to be a little bit more curved back here. Then you can add a couple little curved lines onto the knuckles and a few onto the hands as well. And there you go. Here is your drawing of Humongosaur from Ben 10. I'm going to fast forward and start coloring this. Thanks for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed.